Hey, what's up everybody? So about four months ago in July, I decided, yeah, you know, I want to get some minimalist uh, sandals that I can wear in the summer, you know, feel like I'm walking on the earth, strengthen my feet, my calves, whatever, and you know, be nice and comfortable, not wearing heavy shoes and socks. So I found some Zero Genesis online and I bought them and they never came. I'm just waiting, waiting. I'm emailing the company like, hey, they still didn't come. They said, okay, you know, eight weeks because you live in China, you know, might make it, might not uh, in that time period. So you have to wait eight weeks before we can do any refunds or anything. Eight, nine weeks pass. I write them back, say, hey, it's still not here. They're like, okay, here's a refund. I was like, all right, man, all right, I'm done. And then um, a week ago, I get a call from my old apartment. They say, hey, you have a package. I was like, I don't even live there anymore. So I go pick it up. I'm like, what, what could this be? My zero shoes came. These things are so thin. And uh, yeah, so I was like, oh, this is great, but it's November, so what the heck am I gonna do? And then I decided to go to Thailand. So December 18th, I will be heading to Thailand. I'm gonna wear these every day, check them out to see how they feel as I walk through the mountains and play with elephants and do all these other things that I'm gonna do in Thailand. So let's see how well they hold up. So day one of me wearing uh, my Zero shoes. Actually, it's day one, but it's night. I wore them last night too, broke them in. Uh, yeah, so they're pretty comfortable. It's actually not that bad walking around technically barefoot, right? I feel like uh, a little bit of blisters just from you know using it for the first time, but uh, I don't have any cramping in the feet. Um, I feel comfortable, uh, the ground doesn't hurt. So, I don't know, so far so good. Uh, today I did some walking in some dirt and grassy area with some rocks and I could feel it on my feet but it didn't hurt like but I could feel like you know my, my control of my foot and its contact with the ground but it didn't hurt like you know the rock didn't cut me so it's a pretty cool thing about shoes. So I have day seven, uh, one week of wearing my zero shoes. Uh, mostly walking around on concrete and around the city of Bangkok. But so far, it's been pretty good. My feet are still adjusting. I can still feel a little bit of soreness um, around the, like my balls of my feet, but my heels are good. There's no chafing. Um, I can definitely feel my muscles, new muscles working. Uh, my calves are sore. I got a Thai massage the other day, a leg massage, and uh, it made me feel better, but then then it got worse, you know, I started getting sore. So between the, the massage and wearing these shoes, uh, yeah, I'm feeling it. Wearing my tour shoes has been nice. I've had them on for about nine days now. Um, one thing I noticed is that false feeling of having the shoes on, you know, that the thong part, because uh, I don't normally wear this type of sandals. Uh, even when I don't have the shoes on, I feel like I'm wearing the shoes just in that area right between the toes. Um, yes, yeah, so if you wear them enough and you're not used to them, you're probably going to get that feeling. So walking on very rocky surfaces, you really do feel it through the shoe. Uh, and it doesn't feel good. <laughs> These little rocks are not good to walk on. You get it all stuck in the sandals, very uncomfortable. Be careful of uh, small rocky areas. So I was walking on the beach yesterday and I stepped off a really high step and my zero shoes broke. You can see here the, the, the thong part, the part goes in between the toes, just came out of the hole. The anchor is still there. This is, uh, yeah. So I'm gonna go try to find a place here on the island, see if they can fix the shoe. Uh, if not, I guess I would have to mail it back to zero. But that took four months last time to get the shoe initially. So how long is it gonna take for them to send me a replacement pair? Uh, yeah, I might just suck it up and take the hit. Oh, 13 days with my zero shoes. They, the 13 days that I had them, they were great. Um, 
I thought, you know, just into the barefoot style would be difficult. I only had very few cramps in the legs. Um, maybe not even cramps, just muscle soreness. Um, my feet were generally pretty good. I had no blisters um, where the, you know, the part goes in between the toes or the side where it connected. I had no rubbing, no chafing. Uh, that was a great thing about the zeros and they were so light. I just really forgot I had them on sometimes. Um, just getting used to the feet being flat and then right between the toes there's a little bit of that, that false pain that I talked about earlier. Or not pain, it's like a, just I felt like I had shoes on even when I took them off. And then, uh, so then they broke and it was upsetting. So I bought these and uh, you know, at, at the convenience store and these are the worst shoes ever created ever in the history of ever. This is chafing, this is chafing. And I tried to walk, you know, like two or three kilometers to the night market and it just couldn't do it. I had to go barefoot. And then uh, today, so I had these one whole day. And then today I switched to these. Um, a little bit too big, but uh, so far I've only I've walked maybe a kilometer or two in them and uh, no issues so far. Uh, shoes are important. Man, you don't think about these things. But um, so I did the zeros. Um, I would love if I could get them repaired. Uh, they were great shoes. I love it. Very minimalist. Easy, super easy to travel with. Um, I'm going to call the company, see if I can ship them back. Um, see if it takes less than four months this time to get the shoes. I definitely recommend them. Just be careful of big steps on the beach because apparently they'll, they'll break <laughs> in that situation. Walking, all the other trekking, hiking I did, no problem. So uh, this has been my review. Yeah, if you're a company out there and you want somebody to review your products, uh, especially if it has to do with sports or food or travel, feel free to give me a call. Send me a message, leave me a comment below. I'll see you guys in the next one.